Hey guys, Footy Manager TV here. Welcome to episode number 7 in the second season of my Palermo FIFA 16 career mode series. So, if we just take a look at the table here, uh, we're outside of the top 5 where we need to reach this season. If you're new to the series, and yes, this is the second season, if you're just coming across it now... Uh, you can see the league objective in the second season with Palermo is to qualify for the Europa League. So we need to be finishing at least fifth. So if we continue like how we're playing, I reckon we can. I think it is achievable. But right now, Juventus is on top of us. <laughs> That's a hard team to catch up to. Like All those teams are the teams you would expect kind of to finish in those top five positions. Napoli, Inter, Roma, Lazio and Juve pretty much. But AC Milan is really down below. So, yeah, it may be hard if they have a good well, second half of the season. It's not We're not even at that stage yet. But, yeah, if they kick on this season. Either way, we do have a big game against Kievo Verona. Uh, we'll see if we can change the team up a little bit or if we need to. I don't think we do. Uh, you can see Arroyo again. He's on the bench. S Fine is kind of taken over from him. I don't know if I should, yeah, give him another chance, Arroyo, because he's got strong attributes S Fine, well, he's not 100% fit today. Okay, S Fine, I put on the bench. Could be impact sub. Uh, yeah, like those, like the players from the last game. They're just, they're not too bad. They're not too bad. So it's not like I'm going to sub a lot of players or anything. I think some people have said maybe give Polito, or at least I know one person said that, give him more of a chance. Maybe I will start him for Vasquez here. It changed up a little bit, so uh, that will mean Gonzalez will be the captain for today. But yeah, I'm I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that, because don't forget, Polito's a new signing uh, for this season, so I'll give him a chance. Uh, I did sign him, didn't I? So, yeah, let's get into it, and hopefully get the three points. Oh, Polito, got to be a bit stronger there. Oh, he does. He listened to me. He listened to me. Let's go. Look at the space. Polito, finish. Polito! Could have he scored his first goal for us there. He did so well, and he almost did. Now, Poncho puts it in. Could he get the header on? No. Oh, goes perfectly into the space for them. Oh, Polito does well. Polito, yeah, he's been all right for his rating, I suppose, in this game. Okay, there's an extra number we have. It is Hilliamark. He likes to get forward. Oh, perfect! Perfect! What a goal! Lazar! I'm surprised he was in that position. I think they kind of... Uh, swap positions there, Hilliamark, and yeah, Lazar went central. I suppose that's a bit of my yeah, player instructions as well, but yeah, that worked out. It worked out in the end. Great goal, and I think a deserved goal in this first half. We're having a few chances, but that definitely our uh, most key chance, uh, finding the back of the net, really well worked. See, we played it out wide. Hilliamark cut in like that uh, to put in the ball. Perfect and powerful header. Surprised their goalkeeper didn't get to it. It was a good height. But I'll take that for Lazar. He scores a goal. Hopefully he can yeah, start to score a few more for attacking player. Now, well, Castro knocks it past. And now we have an opportunity. Polito, could he cut in? So the through ball to Toure could happen. Toure with the skill. Toure, Toure. Skills to pay the bills. Skill to pay the bills. Could Lazar score two in one game? No way. He does. It took a deflection. But... That is rare for us. Lazar scores his second in the same game. Who would have thought it? It took a deflection, but yeah, Toure just created that all himself. And Lazar, you see there, took a bit of a deflection. We'll take that. Makes it 2-0. So now it's Castro. Come on, make the interception, Lazar. There's a man on. It's Hilliamark. We have to do this well. We have to do this. Oh! Really? Okay, EA, guys, send this video to EA and tell them, make sure this bullshit isn't in FIFA 17, like, man, if I needed a goal, like, if I wasn't winning, I would even got more, Matt, I just settled down, like, how does that happen? Really? <laughs> Seriously? How, I'm not controlling that other player, so how, oh my god. God, EA, fix that shit. We get rid of it. Here we mark. Oh no, he missed it. He missed it. He missed it. He strikes it and almost gets a wonderish goal late in the game. Just misses. Now goal kick. 
injury time, just about the end of the game, playing out the final seconds. Could we finish in style? The referee blows the whistle to the game there. So pretty solid performance, really good result. Uh, solid performance, as I said. We played really well and got the three points as we wanted. Too easy. And guys here, I just want to view the job openings because I still have in my mind to move to a better team, a bigger team. But right now, there's only offers in Italy. And I'm really telling myself I want to go to the Premier League as I know that pr there'll probably be more interest uh, for that for a Premier League team. So I'm kind of holding off for that. Hopefully, yeah, they will show up. But for now, we've got a game against Bari, but I'm pretty sure they're a bit lower in the table. So, yeah, 19th, haven't won. So, I think we are going to hit this up with a simulated match. They drew against Roma, though, so that's not a terrible result. But big loss against Napoli and Juventus just 1-0, and we beat them expectedly 3-1. They're really struggling this season. So, we do get that win and we will do a training session. So, yeah, I'm getting more interested to, yeah, move to a different team as, yeah, more of you guys are really saying it. Generally, someone says it, <laughs> at least one person in each episode, which makes me kind of think about it more, as I've mentioned. And, yeah, like, really, the lack of interest. Like, my Manchester United series in FM is getting better views and likes than this series is most of the time. So, yeah, that tells me a lot because generally FIFA is more popular than Football Manager on my channel. So yeah, that, that kind of tells me quite a bit. Into November, you can see if we go to the date, it's November 1st. Uh, we'll go to see if there's any more jobs available. Oh, Juventus! That might change my thoughts a little bit. Like, if you guys are really becoming accustomed uh, to this save, you know, this career mode in Italy, should I go Juventus? Because, yeah, there's, like, Milan, Torino, Fiorentina, FC Barcelona. But I've already done a Barcelona career mode for one season. Valencia to move to Spain. But, nah, to me, it's wait for a Premier League offer or go Juventus. So, I don't really know. Yeah, I don't know what's going to happen because I haven't applied for jobs before, at least for a couple of years in career mode. And Juventus, because they're struggling. They want a new manager. Maybe, maybe that could be it. I'll apply for it because that will show myself uh, stepping up a little bit. So did I just, oh, you already have a job application in progress. So let's see what happens with that. Okay, guys, we do get the response back right now. It says, thank you for the interest in the available manager position. We, the board, would like to offer you the manager's job here at Juventus. We look forward to hearing from you soon. I'm actually, I'm really excited now because I do love personally playing with big teams and Juventus is, I don't support Juventus, but they're a favorite of mine. Like I've said it before when I've done Italian saves in Football Manager. I might have in this one, uh, but I do have a lot of friends and a lot of people I know that are kind of from Italy. So I do have the Italian connection in a, you know, a little bit of a way, uh, I suppose. But yeah, uh, to me, I have to accept it. Uh, there's probably a, a section of you guys that yeah may not be too excited about that. Probably a lot of people, though, will be excited that I'll be moving to Juventus. And they've got a bit of a challenge here. Obviously, it's still a good team. But there we go. Setting up a new season. But it's not actually a new season. It's the same season. We're just in November. And I've actually... Um, I've never done this ever in career mode. Because normally, I just like being one team. But suddenly, I'm Juventus. And I don't really know if anyone... Well, of course, these days, so many people make career mode videos. From big YouTubers to medium-sized YouTubers. And smaller YouTubers you probably don't even know about. So, yeah, there's a good chance someone is doing Juventus right now. But, um, yeah, generally, when I search for career mode, I don't really see a Juventus uh, career uh, from maybe a bigger YouTuber that you guys would know that's doing it consistently. So, um, hopefully, yeah, you would think like, yeah, it just seems to me Juventus will be a good team to move to. Uh, cause obviously they'll have more real faces and obviously more players like that. So, and the challenge is to win the title from sixth in November. We have to catch up. We, Palermo, I was on top of Juventus. I was doing better than Juventus with Palermo. So you can see, uh, yeah, the Juventus board really saw that. And it's going to be a tough season. Not a tough season. Obviously, uh, we're going to hopefully do well. But, yeah, uh, we have a good opportunity and at least a challenge to improve. So um, Alaba, 
Oh, no surprises there that Alaba has gone to Juventus. Yeah. Uh, any other kind of notable players? I don't think there's too many, uh, you know, but yeah, the team is looking really strong. Uh, Buffon's still there, 84 overall. Yeah. Oh, David Luiz. Tidy, tidy little uh, player there, right there. Yeah, not too bad. Who's John? Who's this guy? He's... He's uh, 69. Yeah. I just clicked on him pretty much. Well, for two reasons. Because John, that's my name. And uh, his overall was 69. So, <laughs> there you go. But Buffon is still going. And they've got Neto. So, maybe... A, there's like these three different options. To be honest, we'll just we'll just chuck in Buffon. And hold on for a second. I'm, I've moved to Juventus. I'm, <laughs> I'm just realizing it now. How about that? I didn't... Starting this episode, I did not plan... To move, yeah, I, I, I didn't, uh, I don't know, I wasn't really planning anything, to be honest. But, now I'm suddenly Juventus, and I'm below the team I was managing. It's so weird. Anyway, drop a like if you're excited to see the next episode, which will be from, uh, will be at Juventus. I, I, I didn't even know, I can't believe it. I just can't believe it right now. So, maybe leave a suggestion. Would you like me, how, do you want me just to continue, like, the next episode will be, like, season two... And the next episode, or should I start at like episode one and still season two? Because it's like of the whole career. Leave your thoughts. How would you want me to number the next episode? Because yeah, I, I don't even know. I'll probably just can. I'll probably. I'll probably just continue the same the next episode number because it's like the next episode when you're watching a TV series. So yeah, that will make sense. It's the next episode of season two. So I think I will continue that like. Like see, season two, episode eight. I'm just overwhelmed here because I've got a big team job here. So hopefully you guys, yeah, will be pumped up for that. It may take a few days for me to get it uploaded, um, of course, because I have to get a thumbnail created as well. That generally uh, sometimes uh, takes a few days, if not up to a week. So uh, we'll just have to see how we go with that. And I'll see you guys in the very next episode.